What's up guys and welcome back to another video. I'm Seven Beats and in this video I'm gonna show you how to make really awesome reggaeton beats like Tiny. Make sure to check out my Latin sample pack, the link is in the description and include all the sounds which are used in this tutorial. So let's go right into the beat. In this tutorial I'm gonna make a track which is a little bit similar to a new track from Tiny and Yandel which is called Camara Lenta. So let's go right into it. So first we're gonna set the tempo to 85, which is used a lot in those reggaeton beats. And I'm going to select the Mellotron 5. And Tiny is using this one in a lot of his tracks. And I'm gonna start off with this preset, the Strawberry Flutes. This one, I'm gonna create a really simple ARP. And we really want to create a dark melody, so just pick a random skill. I'm gonna start off with this G sharp and flat G. So create a melody like this. I'm gonna duplicate this one right here. And equal to E is this B flat right here. And as you can see, we want to turn up this one, a few notes right here, and just pick this G flip. Really fire. So duplicate this one. Really fire and just randomize the velocity and that's it. And right now we want to add some effects to this synth. So we're going to link it to a random mixer channel. And first I'm going to add some saturation. So I'm going to use the Saturn 2, but you can also use the soft clipper. this and then I'm going to use some compression so I'm going to use the O2T multiband compressor and I'm going to add this RC20 and I'm going to add some more bounce to the synth right here so I'm going to use some side chaining and I'm using Kickstart from Nicky Romero at around 50%. And I'm going to use an EQ to cut out some of the annoying frequencies. Right here. And this synth really contains a lot of noise. So I've reduced the noise right here. And right now I'm gonna add some reverb. So I'm going to use the Valhalla Vintage Verb. It's the second preset. Really fire. So right now I'm gonna add some drums. So I'm going to use the Latin sample pack. So I've selected three snares. This one, this one, and this one. And I'm gonna create a really basic rhythm. Like this, the most common reggaeton rhythm. So I'm throwing this one down. Just a sample. And I've created this part right here, which I think sounds really cool. So I'm going to layer this one with snare nine. Also layer this one with snare 10. So I'm going to link those three elements to the mixer. I'm going to use this one right here. I'm going to turn down the volume of snare 10. All right, now I'm gonna add the kick. So I'm going to use this one and just create a really basic pattern like this.
but we want to add a typical drum pattern. I'm going to use this one right here. This contains a lot of low frequencies, so I'm going to reduce those frequencies like this. And right now I'm going to duplicate this pattern into this one. Link those elements to the mixer. Pick this head right here and copy the same pattern from the kick to the head. To add some more high frequencies. And right now we want to add the bass line. So right now I'm going to use the Mini V3. And this one is also used in a lot of tiny tracks, bass. And we're going to select a bass you will use. This one, which contains some resonance. And we're going to create a pattern like this. So just select those G's. So and I'm, and I'm going to use an E right here. And I'm going to expand the melody a little bit like this. And we also want to add a bass for the intro. So I'm going to use Analog Lab 5. And I'm going to use this bass right here. So I'm going to solo the melody and the bass right here. And link this one to the mixer and cut out some of the high frequencies. So I'm going to create a high cut filter. So that's basically it. And right now I'm going to create a really simple arrangement. So how can you create a really simple arrangement? So separate all the elements right here and I'm going to make an adjustment to this one right here like this i'm going to create in this case just a really simple eight bar pattern so i've created this really simple arrangement and right now it sounds like this Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. Make sure to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also make sure to subscribe, it would really help me. And see you guys in one of my next tutorials.